Hi, it's Daniel again from WP Social and in this video I'm going to show you how to use different Google Reach snippets for you, how to integrate the, the different Google Reach snippets into your content. If you go to post, I have already prepared some posts, so we're going to look at the review first. You can write content here, your normal content like you would with every other content and then when you scroll down you see the WP Social SEO Booster meta box. Click on the review tab then you can choose the, the location where the review overview should be displayed on then you can enter a product name and the name of the product which you are reviewing, the type it's optional then the version of the product it's also optional um, but what you need to enter is the author name the name of the author who did create um, who did write the review so that, that would be you um, if you leave it empty then it will automatically take the author from from the from WordPress the date Um, if you leave that one empty then it will also take the date from WordPress from the publishing here then you can give it a rating your rating here you can choose that which one you want to give then the product author it's also optional a link to the product this can also be an affiliate link of course um, the price you need to include here the the currency sign then enter the currency and then you can write a short summary of the review after you have done that just click on update or save whatever it will be then when we are going to check the post then it will add this box with all the information you entered and on Google if Google does index your review then you have an example here this is how it can look like when Google does um, index your review it will add the star rating and also your picture from your Google Plus profile. We not only support the review but also all other rich snippets which are supported by Google. So here we have the receipt. Um, you can enter all the information here you can upload an image just follow the information here it's really easy and you can see here for the ingredients you can add one more by clicking on the plus icon or you can delete them again the same for the directions if you want to add more just click on the plus icon and if you want to delete one on the minus icon then you can give it the rating you can enter a title for the rating and then enter your rating here um, I'm going to show that on the top update and then we're going to look at it so this will it will look then like that it will add all the information about you you see the image you uploaded and all the different information and when Google does index that you have an example here of the receipt it will add the image of your receipt the rating and 
also the picture of your of you from your Google Plus profile. You can see here I have two ratings and this is com combined with our rating system within the plug which is built into the plugin and if you add that and use it to rate your content then it will also show up in the in the search engine listings the same is for software also for software it does add the star rating it does add the information you entered for what kind of system the software is um, coded for and also does all always add your image if we go back here you can see the software example I have added and you also can add product you can combine that you can combine you with the product so you can enter the information for the product here and it will also show up the product rich snippets will only be added to the code and won't be shown on the content itself it's just for the Google rich snippets if you if this is a business entry then you can enter more information for Google so it knows but um, gets more information about the business the same for people um, videos if you use videos you can enter the information here about the video this won't show up on the content either it's just for Google so Google does support this video mark app for better understanding your videos and then if you have events then you also can enter the events these are all the different rich snippets content types Google does support and we are also the support them within our plugin and if Google will add support more of the rich snippets and of course we will update the plugin and add support for them too it's <coughs> really easy about uh, to use all the different rich snippets just follow the instructions here or go back to the manual where we also have different instructions about how to use all the different settings. Thanks and have a great day.